Hello and welcome back everyone to the climax of the story. We are finally ending the man who erased his name. Uh, thank God, I have completed this game. Now this game is not in the game pass. He is on his way from the joint. You will have to purchase this game. In a different time, we would have rolled out the red carpet. But meeting at the prisons and no good. This is the climax. I will say enjoy the show. And I will meet you in that. Yeah. I know. I bet. You did ten years, didn't you? For killing your boss, no less. Us smashing up the Omi today ain't so different, is it? What gives, Shishido? You scared all of a sudden? Those decades of Yakuza families, all that history, and we're gonna tear it all down. Ain't you nervous, Captain? Maybe a bit, but my mind's made up. And you'd better watch yourself. Don't say stupid shit like that round the boss. Of course. Welcome back, boss. Where's Thanks. He? Thank oh, you for all you've done for us. Where's he? I could say the same. Where's he? Haven't changed a bit, boss. Welcome back. Serino. Shishido. You two did good. See, you brought a dragon back from the dead. Couldn't have been easy. Sure wasn't, but 50 billion goes a long way. The Daidoji were willing to let out his leash a bit. Thanks for coming, Kiryuhan. Guess I'm not the only one in a tough spot here. You know how much cash I ran through to find you? You're already talking about money? Man, I knew it was more about ideals. Ha! Ah, big talk coming from a dead man. None of it ever made any goddamn sense, did it? The dragon of Dojima died, but no one saw the body. Who'd be dumb enough to fall for that shit? Fooled everyone but you. Only one you're fooling is yourself. Anyway, forget all that. We got a big event today, and I can't pull it off without you. This is the day the Yakuza end. Yeah, making a big move. You and Daigo both. We didn't choose this. The times forced us to. Politicians, cops, they treat us like we ain't even people. Then justify it with one bullshit law or another. Only future we got as Yakuza is as lapdogs or underground thugs. Seems that way. But we can still make ourselves a third option. We dissolve the groups and get as many of the Yakuza as we can into our safety net. But the longer we wait, the less we can do. And more and more Yakuza will fall by the wayside. Truthfully, I can't say if that's the right choice. I'm hardly qualified to. But either way, you're putting your lives on the line to do this. That's reason enough for me to help. Look, I realize you got Daijoji breathing down your neck. But putting two giants like Omi and Tojo to rest... ...didn't take living legends. <laughs> And a dead one, I suppose. I'm counting on you, Kiryuan. Boss, do you have the letter of dissolution? Huh? This is a historic moment. How about I get you in a badass pose holding the paperwork? Hey, quit screwing around. Aw, oh, come on. Everybody's snapping pics these days. Right, Kiryu-san? Whoa, 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 knock it off. The fuck's wrong with you? Captain of the Omi Alliance, conspiring with the supposedly dead former fourth chairman of the Tojo clan. 
plotting to betray his family and disband Naomi? He's got the Declaration of Dissolution addressed to the police right there in his pocket. I get it. You're against all this. Shishido. Omi, new or old, see this video right here? Rank be damned, they'll kill you. On top of that, they'll see it was me who exposed you. I'll be the goddamn hero. What are you saying? To start, I'll be taking over the Watase family. <laughs> Already had the groundwork laid. What? All of you? <sighs> so the Patriarch and the Captain weren't with us. No shit that'd have everyone turned on you. You were so busy licking Watase's boots. You forgot about everyone else under you. Just means you didn't have the damn balls. And you think you're any different? I know my place in the world. I'll take it step by step. Patriarch will be the first for me. Then it'll be the top of the Omi Alliance. That's some pretty big top there. I wasn't raised that great, you know. When I can take my shot, I make sure I put my life on it. Two long years. I've been waiting for this. To expose the Omi Alliance's greatest threat. You backstabbing rat fucks! So you were against us all this fucking time. Asshole. You two turned on us first. Turn your back on us! <laughs> <laughs> Kazuma Kiryu, Imasaru Watase. You're both dead as fuck. You wrinkly ass traitors! What? How? I'm the one who killed him. Remember? Kiryu san was there, but I had my back to him. He couldn't see a thing. So I just pretended to stab him with a little toy that spurts blood. Had a rescue team nearby and everything. All went according to plan. Well made, unlike yours. But why, Shishido? Don't you hate Nishitani too? How could you? You're not wrong. Patriarch Nishitani's had me under his thumb forever. It's been a living hell for years on end. And you're the one who saved my ass, Captain. So this is how you repay the favor? <laughs> you know, I was a good-for-nothing little shit as a kid. But now, I strut around this fucking town head high. Out having those glitzy nights I always dreamed about. And once I knuckled up and stood on the winning side, I learned. There ain't nothing better than having the run of somebody. Because you're stronger than them, and they're piss scared of you. Damn you. A full belly, clothes on my back, women in my bed. Maybe you think all that was a gift from you. What? But you'd be fucking wrong. I'm the one who clawed my way up from nothing. You just gave me a little boost in the home stretch. God. Getting ordered around by a smug asshole like you. So sure his shit don't stink. I can't count how many times I've wanted to strangle you. I don't know how I managed not to. I don't owe you a goddamn thing. Everything I got, I got because I fought and won and took it my own fucking self. And you're planning to do what again? Break up the group? Dissolve the Omi Alliance? Fuck out of here with that. You go senile and lock up or something, you dickless piece of shit. Shishido. But while you all were flipping your shit over your little conspiracy, I still didn't have any proof. That's why I held on till the time was right. Even with proof, 
I'm not an idiot of your caliber. I know I can't rebuild the Omi alone. You gotta show people a vision for the future, or else nobody will follow you. But with the Kijin clan at my back, everything's taken care of. After I saved Patriarch Nishitani from the fire, I laid all my cards on the table for him. How Kazuma Kiryu survived. About the plot to dissolve the Omi Alliance and the Tojo clan. A shocking betrayal. An unforgivable conspiracy. Isn't that right, Watase Anaki? You recognize what I had back then? Didn't even care that I just left the Chingon Mafia, did you? Power is all that matters, hey? You show those weren't empty words. I figured you for a real man's man. So I didn't mind getting my hands dirty for you. Who do you have to thank for that squeaky clean image of yours, huh? And now you throw me to the wolves because I'm in the way of your scheme? Kill him? Get rid of him? Sounds damn crazy, right? No, I'm the one who ordered you to be killed. Shut your fucking mouth, Cyrano! Hawking's not going to save you. Tase Anaki here betrayed me. Just like he betrayed the Omi Alliance. You know how much that stings for us? You got any idea? But you, Shishido, you've gone above and beyond. What a guy. I love ya! If you all don't want the Omi Alliance, then we'll take it for ourselves. What was that about bootlicking earlier? Looks like you're happy to do just the same. Damn right. And look what that lick bought me. Let me be frank, Kiryu Han. I wasn't expecting this. Squaring off against the Watasi family and Kijin both? Who'd have figured? Here I thought the worst fit would be at Omi HQ. Yeah, me too. So, if you lost your edge in the joint, we're done for. Huh, didn't that tell you been planning this day for years? I ain't gone soft even a little. Can't speak for you, though. Well, that gives me a bit of hope. What about you, Suno? Huh? Me? I get to fight with a couple of legends. You think I'd pass up being part of that trio? Fact is, I'm so fucking mad right now, you couldn't stop me if you tried. Perfect. Shishido, your plan may have been years in the making. But you missed one major detail. Yeah? What do you think will happen if you don't kill us here and now? You'd have to start all over again, wouldn't you? Do you think you have enough manpower to take us down? Now here's a moment worth saving. Shoot another video, now. Show everyone in the Omni Alliance what we're made of. Hell yes! Get rid of these relics. The new Omi Alliance begins now. Kill them all! Let's go! Here we go. <laughs> Hold out. <laughs> 
Did this happen? Appreciate the time. Got a warm up thanks to you. Sorry to break it to you like this, but the show's got to go on. I ain't finished with you, fucker! Press a scoop there. Figured you needed a hand, so I made sure to step on it here. Perhaps I may have gone a little overboard. Hanawa, what are you doing here? What about me? Akame's been giving us info on Soten Bori lately. She's got her fingers in every pie in this city, so to speak. And today, she got a tip that someone resembling Nishitani was spotted around town. Dead man walking. Yep, just a little bit ago. I worried I may be imposing, but I decided to check in on you anyway. Limo and all. <laughs> Didn't want to show up empty-handed. Can't have the Omi captain riding in anything less. Have a new suit, Joryu. You're covered in blood, you know. You've got some thoughtful friends. You're telling me. Hey, I got something for you too, boss. I get Didn't I tell you? This is just the beginning. <laughs> yeah, yeah. This might sting a little, but it'll hide the cuts. Wouldn't be a good look for breaking up the Omi. They'd think your own guard dog bit you. I don't need salt rubbed in with the makeup. I get the picture. 
The bleeding on your belly stopped, but that's all. Try to move as little as possible, all right? Shit! Ah, oh, that's smart! You'll need some rest, Cyrano son. If you can't even walk, I'm afraid there's not much else you can do. Fuck off! The boss is the one who got gut shanked. And I worked hard as hell for a long time to make this day a reality. I ain't about to split right when things get good. Good grief. How can you stick your neck out so far for those above you? The Yakuza lifestyle is alien to me. He's a rare sort these days. So, what do we do about Nishitani? Don't worry. Someone from Daidoji will be around to pick him up soon. We should be leaving shortly. Sorry to keep y'all waiting. Watase-san's scarless makeover is complete. You guys can head to Omi HQ now. I'll say goodbye to you here. Oh? Huh? What's up, Joryu? When we first met, I never imagined you'd end up doing so much for me. Thank you, Akame. I really mean it. Huh? Why are you making it sound like we're never gonna see each other again? <laughs> Sorry. Guess I sounded pretty serious. Well, listen up, Joryu. I'm gonna have work for you when you get back. I'll be counting on you? Sure thing. Now we're finally back on track. Oh, not exactly. I counted Shishido on my side, but now he's gone and I got a knife to the gut. Sarno's got a banged up leg, too. That may be, but at least you're being chauffeured in a limousine. The Omi captain shouldn't bellyache so much. Though I suppose you've been stabbed there. Hey, shut your goddamn mouth already! This ain't the time to be flapping your fucking lips like usual. Uh, guys, come on. I'm the one sitting here with all this shit speckled on my face. I gotta stand tall once we get to HQ. Give me a break for now, will ya? Uh, whatever you say. How much further, Hanawa? About 10 minutes. That means in 15, the Omi Tojo dissolution will have been declared. I'm about to light a powder keg loaded with who the hell knows what. Right. And the role you play may be the most important one of all. You're reading the Yakuza its last rites. And you know as well as I do. You're the only one who can pull that off. Do declarations of dissolution even exist? They do now. Got one right here. Feels like I wrote out my last will and testament. Probably similar enough. No one can say what comes next. Best be ready for the worst. is quite the sight, being greeted by the young leaders of the Alliance like this. So, these are the folks you're breaking the bad news to? Ah, uh, shut up already. Watase, how's your wound holding up? Oh, it's only the worst pain I've ever felt. I try to keep a straight face. I'll protect you with my life. No one will lay a finger on you. Then uh, knock it off. You damn charmer. This is where I make my exit. I hope it all goes well for you. We've been through some shit, haven't we? Joyu, don't forget, you're still a Daidoji man. It's imperative you come back in one piece. Right.
The Omi Alliance of Kansai started off as the idea of a few ambitious men more than 100 years ago. In the early days, we were fierce, ready to go to war at any moment. Although we only fought against other factions, we know these wars took a heavy toll on the people here in the city we call home. And for that, we are deeply sorry. <laughs> Therefore, on this day, the presiding chairman does declare, and I, Captain Watase, do cosign this official document, which proclaims the Omi Alliance of Kansai, is hereby dissolved. Huh? What the fuck? This we pledge to the Osaka PD. What? Why are you doing this, Captain? What are you thinking? Dojima, sixth chairman of the Tojo clan. Tojo clan? The fuck's he doing here? I think it's time. Let's do it. As the Omi Alliance does, so shall we. The Tojo clan is also officially dissolved. Watase-san and I will serve as each other's witnesses as we each end our factions together. This decision was ratified by the Omi chairman, Captain Watase, and acting Captain Masumi Arakawa. Bullshit! What kind of shady crap is that? Fuck you, Watase! You're a goddamn traitor! Sajima. <laughs> I made sure this would be nice and sharp for today. I really want to test it out. Any volunteers? <laughs> Majima san. We're gonna march this declaration down to Osaka PD. I know, most of you are none too happy about it. So listen up. If you consider yourself real Yakuza, then you'll have to stop me by force. <laughs> Good shit. I'm starting to see the big picture, Arakawa Han. So that's him, Masumi Arakawa. Sure is. This kind of brawl, most of us never live to see one like it. So if we're gonna make history here, you bet your ass I'm gonna take a stand with the side having the most fun. You twisting the knife on us, Tendo? <laughs> I'd much rather fight with you than against you. Things are about to get real spicy now. Hey. See that scraggly fella next to Tendo over there? He's that Kasuga guy I was talking about. Finally time to step out of the shadows, huh? Look at us. We're about to have the fight of our lives just to get that point across. With the Yakuza legends at our side. Let's make it one to remember! That's our cue. Right. They've all got eyes on Watase and Daigo. We need to protect them. Damn it. This is gone far enough. Watase! Shit! Uh, uh, uh. What's say? What the? <laughs> I knew you weren't really gone. So he's finally back. The dragon of Dojima. Sase, how did you find him? Who, him? <laughs> I don't know what you're talking about. He's just some extra muscle. Some bodyguard I hired. Couldn't even tell you his name. 
Leave this part to me. You guys worry about the front line. I'll protect the back even if it costs me my life. <laughs> I don't know who you are, but you sure know how to make an entrance. God damn, seriously? Share the spotlight, would you, Kiryu-san? Seconds. This feast ain't over till it's over. <sighs> Here we go. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> Give him a taste of my fists. <laughs> Sorry, no one gets past you. And if you want to try, you'll have to get through me first. Is that all of them? Nice. We did it.
Kiryu-san. Don't take this the wrong way, Dojima-san. It's just that my bodyguard, well, he's not anybody whose name you would know. You might be thinking he looks real damn familiar, but it ain't him. Hold on. I hired him from a temple called Dido something or other, I think it was. That's all I got. Puzzle it out for yourself. Understood. Well, we're done here. Let's go. Mm. Everyone, come this way. <laughs> Good luck out there, Kasuga. You're gonna do great. Uh, that is way, the way easier than I thought it would for be. The third part of your <laughs> kind of a letdown, huh? You say that, but this shit's exhausting. Felt like I lose my damn lunch. <laughs> <sighs> Still, guess this really is the end, huh? The Omi and the Tojo are done like dinner. Ah, smell you later, guys. <sighs> oh, I know. How about a party to celebrate, eh? Could really go for some tripe right about now. Of course, we can't forget to bring Mr. Bodyguard along. Thanks. But no thanks. Oh, come on. Just a few drinks. You know, I never bought it. The whole thing about you dying and all was a load of bullshit. Kill you, Chun. You've got the wrong guy. Sorry, but I've never met you. The hell? Look me in the eye and tell me you expect me to keep playing along with this shit. I'm not asking you to do anything for me. You can move on and forget about it once I'm gone. Yeah, yeah, whatever. I'll go along with your little charade for now, okay? So no leaving. My heart can't take it. Huh. <laughs> huh? What's that? We're here, Shido. You're still standing? If Luke's could kill, we'd be in trouble about now. So he hasn't learned his lesson. Guess it's on me to teach it. Hey. You didn't finish the job? Why not, you gun sock? That or is one hell of a cockroach. You're not getting off that easy. Not while I'm still sucking air. If you want to fuck with the Omi Alliance, I'm pushing back till I'm dead in the ground. It's over, Shishido. Cut the crap. This is freaking pathetic, man. You stay the fuck out of the way, traitor. Shishido. Cornered animal at this point. Don't look like he's got anything left to lose. What are you doing, Majima? Get the fuck off me! Is that the best you got? Look at me. I'm still kicking assholes. And not just me. The whole Omi Alliance. Ain't that right? Why is that? They all just survive and woke up? Stubborn shit like this here. That's what the Omi was best at. <clears throat> What's up, son? You're hurt. Boss! I guess before we go to the cops, I gotta change again, huh? Now listen here! If we don't kill these bastards right now, the Yakuza are done for good. 
You okay being crushed by rats? Dying on the ground? With all the pride of a soggy goddamn napkin? Don't forget who you are! The Omi fucking Alliance! Yeah! Yeah! Well, they certainly feel like zombies. Strength and terror. That's how you dominate. Show these cowards some real Yakuza! God damn it. We need to shut him up. It's fine. Well, let him go all the way. Hey! They're still in the garden! It's time! Get moving! Kill these shitbird traitors! For years they've been scheming behind all our backs to make this happen. Creeping in the shadows, pulling the strings, making us prance around like they're little puppets. Fuck that shit! Don't try to tell me any one of you's okay with that! Fuck it ain't right when I... They can take their dissolution and stick it up their motherfucking asses! Don't forget about those Tojo pricks, neither. Anyone standing in our way is dead. I want it rain and blood! <laughs> they got a real fire under their ass now! God damn it! That's why I said we needed to shut his mouth. Wouldn't matter. <sighs> These guys aren't gonna back down. Not until they've given it every last thing they've got. Shishido. Nishitani. They're old school Yakuza, all right. They put on a big show to make everyone fall in line. And just as long as all that helps them get whatever they're looking for, nothing's off limits to them. Every single Yakuza faction, they ran on guys like that. Got a lot of good use out of them. So if we really want to dissolve the Yakuza, we have no choice but to meet them head on and make sure we finish the job for good. That's the only way we're really gonna bring an end to all this. We step up, here and now. Because we're the only ones that can make it happen. Hmm. Bodyguard knows what he's talking about. These guys, they ain't gonna see it that way unless we force them to. Ain't that right, Dojima-san? <laughs> Feeling like... I'm the only one with no balls here. Don't say that. All this right here, none of it happens if not for you and Watase. Dismantling Japan's two biggest Yakuza groups? You ask me, that takes balls of steel. <laughs> Fair enough. Well then, today, the Tojo clan goes out with a bang! What? What's up with these guys? There's that good shit. Let's go! Come on, let's dance! Three dragons, one demon, again. Okay. Here we go. <laughs> Oh, no! 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 Oh,
Kiryu-san! Over there! He's headed for HQ! You bastard! Let's finish this, Kiryu! Shisho! You bitches! This ain't over yet! My lord, round three? Get going, Kiryu. Leave these clowns to us. You said he was yours, right? Then go have your fun. Make sure you teach him a real good lesson. Got it. Appreciate the help. Even though we just met. <laughs> you always were stubborn, Kiryu-chan. My balls, my balls. Oh, why are you talking about the family man? The guy who sits the Great Hall. In this spot right here. He's the one who runs everything. Just one word. That's all it would take to mobilize every Yakuza in Japan. That's the kind of strength we're all dreaming of! That's not the world we live in anymore. I think you ought to know that well enough by now. Don't you fucking tell me what I know! Maybe none of this matters to you. You sat the Tojo throne, even if it didn't last. But some of us got no choice. If being a Yakuza is the only life you know, then this room's all you fucking have! This place? It's the dream. And without it, we're dead! The dream, huh? Hm. <laughs> Golden Boy like you could never understand. You'll never know what it is you've taken from us. I get it. Do you? I can erase my name. I can deny who I am. But deep down, I'm the same as you. You hear someone out there stronger. And soon your only thought is how to defeat them. You want to prove you're unmatched? Then bask in the glory. That's how we're built. If that's how we're built, then why the fuck did you help tear it all down? Why would you take our goddamn dream away? That's easy. Because compared to the hopes and dreams of everyone else out there, ordinary people just struggling to get through their daily lives, our dream isn't worth a damn.
kill you. You may have fucked everything sideways showing up here and raising hell, but at least I'll get to kill you myself. And once that's done, those little shits are next. You want to rattle me so bad you can taste it. But doesn't change the fact that this ends right here. No matter how many bullshit threats you throw at me. Ha! All done then? Doesn't change shit. Think I give a shit about some legendary Yakuza? All you fucks! I'll murder every one of you!
Assholes looking at. The Omi Alliance disbands as of today. For all your kicking and screaming, you couldn't stop the boss or the Tojo clan. We won. You put up a good fight. I'll give you that. Time to go. Nothing more for us here. Say, come on, get in. I'll give you guys a lift. I brought you another change of clothes, Watase san. Thoughtful as ever. Thanks for that. Of course, I think you'll fit. Might be a little tight, though. <laughs> <laughs> Well, well, got some guts, don't you? Trying to pull a fast one at a daidoji. Pretty slick for a two-bit thug. Personally, I'd end you right here and be done with it. But you'll make a fine agent, so you can keep your life. be on a damn short leash till the day you die. But don't worry. Nishitani will be there too, so you won't be lonely. No! Already tired of meditating. That's a rare sight. I just couldn't free myself from worldly desires. When I told him, he gave me this. 
The road to enlightenment is long and arduous. We all need to take a break once in a while. I'm not certain anyone will reach enlightenment from here. <laughs> How uncharitable. You have more work for me? No. You need some time to cool off. You barely had enough time to catch your breath after all you've done in Osaka and Yokohama. Yeah, guess so. So the legendary dragon's chosen Ichiban Kasuga as his successor. Now that I think of it, there is a resemblance. Going to jail for the crimes of others. No, wait. Isn't that what Yakuza do all the time? I don't think of it as some grand statement about a successor. But, after the dissolution, I just wanted to help with the burden he had to carry, however I could. Before you encouraged him, he was just some thug fresh out of jail. And that thug went on to stop Ryo Aoki from going mad with power. The Daidoji couldn't overlook Aoki going rogue like that. Without your help, there's no way Kasuga could have done so much, don't you think? I didn't give the kid superpowers. He was already strong enough. We just ran into each other. That's all. Still... What are you getting at? Stop beating around the bush. You came here because you needed me for something, right? Oh, yes. That's right. The Daijoji are offering you a reward for your services. A reward? It's been said before, but your work has proven very effective. After all, it got us 50 billion yen in assets. And, on a personal note, it also saved my life. Leaving that debt unpaid doesn't sit right. So, first of all, I'd like to show you this. You haven't seen this before, have you? It's your grave in Okinawa. Our hidden cameras filmed this. The same ones that we used to monitor the orphanage kids. This was taken on the anniversary of your death. <gasps> Haruto-kun was around four at the time, huh? Growing up nicely indeed. <laughs> the camera's positioned far away, so they don't know they're being watched. Your last two visitors that day were Taichi-kun and Ayako-san. After a while, Ayako-san spotted the camera. She might have noticed light reflecting off the lens. Hey, Taichi. Is that... is that a camera I'm seeing? Yep. Looks like it. Pointed at Uncle Kaz's grave? If it's a hidden camera, then someone's probably watching us. Does that mean. Do you think Uncle Kaz set it up? If Uncle Kaz is really still alive, then maybe he did. <laughs> Yo, Uncle Kaz! So oh, come on, what do you think you're doing? What? There's a chance he might see this, right? Huh? We got nothing to lose, so let's try. Hmm. Hey, Uncle Kaz! <laughs> Can you see me okay? It's Taichi! And... Ayako is here too. <laughs> <laughs> We're all doing great! Same with Haruka and Haruto. Shiro, Izumi, Koji, Mitsuo, Riona, and Eri... Everybody's doing well. And plus, to be honest with you, nobody here actually believes that you're, um, dead. <laughs> I'm serious. Hey, Uncle Kaz. 
So, I'm a firefighter now. When bad things happen and people who are in trouble need help, I want to be the one who steps up when no one else has the courage. It's probably because I grew up watching you. As for me, I got a job at a small office. I fought really hard to get it, and it worked out. Koji's working for a company now, too. Riona got a job in fashion. Ari wants to work with little kids. Izumi went and became an animal groomer. <laughs> she had lots of practice on Mame. <laughs> Mitsuo's working all kinds of jobs. And Shiro's majoring in science. Haruto's, well... <laughs> Lately, he's been a bit of a pain. Take your eyes off him for a second and he's gone. It's driving Haruka and you just sound crazy. We know. You must have a lot going on, too. Because if you were alive, you'd definitely come see us, right? Maybe. Maybe if you really are somewhere out there, you could send us a sign? We're all making our way just fine on our own, so it's not like we'd ask you to take care of us or anything. Just... It's only that we wouldn't want for you to... Be lonely? Out there, all on your own? If you did give us a sign, we wouldn't tell anyone outside Morning Glory. And when you're ready, we'll all be waiting for you to come back. Looking forward to it. Yeah, we are. Taichi and I are finally old enough to drink, too. I bet we'll have a fun time. We've got so much to talk about. <laughs> oh, right. We're going to come back again tomorrow. There's something we want you to have. And plus, I want Haruka and the others to say hi, too. What is it that you wanted to bring for him? I shall be right. Oh, yeah, that's great. Anyway, see you tomorrow. Bye, Uncle Kaz. <laughs> <laughs> Unfortunately, the camera was collected by an agent soon after this video was taken. Once the kids discovered the camera, we had no other choice. <laughs> right. I understand. I had wondered to myself whether showing you this would really constitute a reward. I'm still unsure. It is. I'm really grateful. You did. <laughs> You'll recall, Taichi-kun said he had something he wanted to give you. On the day after the camera was retrieved, they went back, all the children of Morning Glory together, and left a small tube containing a picture. Now clearly, we couldn't let them think that Kazuma Kiryu a dead man had been there to receive it. Ultimately, we decided to leave it there, but had one of our agents take a photograph of it first. <laughs> Haruto-kun drew this. <laughs> That's you in the middle, isn't it? This is just great. Haruto. <laughs> Will you look at that? He's four now. He can read and write already. The last time I saw him, he couldn't even... He couldn't even talk. And now he's... <laughs> he's really coming along. Haruka-san, too. All of the children are. It's true. They're all making their own way just fine without me. And here I am, alone. I can't even tell them how much I miss them. I needed them more than 
they ever needed me. <laughs> that boy earlier, <clears throat> he said he wanted to show the courage to step in and help others when no one else would, didn't he? Surely you must realize you set that example for them. Hearing you say that doesn't make me feel any better. I can't do a damn thing other than sit here and meditate. Uh, which reminds me, Hanua-san suggested you take some time off and travel. It's already been approved by those in charge. Your vacation has no set time limit. You're welcome to go if you're interested. Make no mistake, though. As far as the world knows, Kazuma Kiryu will remain a dead man. Wherever you go, whatever you do, we'll be watching. So, my training's complete then. <laughs> this temple is just for appearances, as indeed am I. Your training will be there with you no matter where you go. It's time to move on. Is Hawaii going to be your first stop? I think I'll be saving the best for last. So, putting others before yourself again, are we? <laughs> you never change. Well, well. I see you've grown quite trusting of Kiryu-san. Trust has nothing to do with it. Distinguished performance earns a distinguished reward. You can call it meritocratic. Securing his gratitude is to our advantage. It sets a good example for the other pawns in our collection. One other thing. The Dragon of Dojima is quite a fearsome ally. We would be unwise to make him an enemy. Clearly. That's why we don't want to get too involved. Hanawakun, he does understand his place, doesn't he? Indeed he does. Ought to be everything. Credit card, ID, all under your new name. Appreciate that. The faction approved it, so I did my job. That's all it was. Our relationship is strictly a business one, after all. It'll mean problems for both of us, if anyone thinks that you and I have become friends. Right. That'll work just fine. For us. Joyu was too on the nose to be a fitting alias. So I took the liberty and chose Tai Chi Suzuki for you. <laughs> Just so happens that a few years back, I used this exact same name. Yes, I'm aware. I don't remember telling you anything about that. Or anyone else here, for that matter. <sighs> well, the truth is, before I became a Daidoji member, I actually had another opportunity to get to know you. First time I'm hearing it. Well, we really are one and the same. How's that? Because we are both men who've found a new life. Men who have abandoned even their own names. <laughs> In other words, there are many more secrets you are not privy to. Well... Story of my life. Please do take care of yourself. Kill you, son. See you around. Well, that's the end. We have finally reached the 
10 pounds of story guys i hope i seriously hope that you all have enjoyed as much as i did because you know i was like trying to play this game for a very very long time the yakuza series and i picked it up after the prime series was released so and having it on the uh, you know game pass also helped so a lot of things happened in the story a lot of fun moments a uh, lot of fun interaction with some of the real girls you know we have some different videos for that but yeah the overall story as i said this whole game is just gonna be brawl 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 and 10x time of that cutscene and we have now gone through all those cutscenes we now know that kiryu or in this scenario joryu is free from his cage if you want to know more like how he got into daidoji faction and uh, why did he has to get involved with daidoji you can start watching the series on amazon prime season 1 is out i think season 2 will cover the part where he actually goes in and joins daidoji most probably it will be the end of season 2 or start of season 3 something like that and from there on the man who erases his name this whole story will go on and start there is one more part i think its name is uh, like a dragon ishin that's the third and final part of the series and there is one more that is upcoming right now uh, which is related to pirate yakuza's yeah it it sounds odd it is odd but let's see what happens when the game is out and uh, yeah i hope that that particular game is also successful because the whole yakuza series is very very successful uh, for the people between the people actually who plays single player games and love stories you know there are people who love playing games there are people who love playing games with stories and there are people who love playing who love watching stories in which game is an element so yakuza is a series where game is an element of a story not the other way around and on that note i will leave you guys for the day i hope you have enjoyed this whole series the playlist will be there so you can watch it from the start to end without any worries without any skips the main story is completely covered thanks for joining me guys in this particular journey of yakuza i hope you have enjoyed it if you did please do like the videos and make sure to subscribe to the channel so that whenever i post the next gameplay or whenever i go live you get a notification for that bye bye guys have a wonderful wonderful day